Hey, hi, hello, and welcome. So we're gonna be using the pull-up bar in this workout to target our abdominal muscles in order to get a flat stomach. So to be totally fair, these are extremely challenging. I still struggle with them the whole way through. You do need to have a little bit of experience on the pull-up bar, being able to hold yourself up. You can do this by just hanging rather than fully holding yourself up on the pull-up bar. Besides doing like planks, I think that these are truly the best exercises to do for a flat stomach, especially if you wanna get a flat stomach as soon as possible. Um, also, don't forget to check out my other videos where I talk about how to get a flat stomach in a week. If you implement all of these tools, you can see some serious results in a very short period of time. We're gonna be doing three different exercises in pyramid style. So we're gonna be doing three rounds, doing 10 reps the first round, eight reps the second round, and six reps on the third round. And you can follow along with me and do this or just watch me for fun. Let's jump into the workout. So for the first exercise, we're gonna be up into a chin up and you can Jump up and hold yourself. Um, we're gonna be holding ourselves up there the whole time while we do leg lifts. So we're gonna start with 10 here and then we'll move on to the next exercise. So go nice and slow. One, two. So it's really important not to be like swinging your back back and forth. You really wanna to try to keep your upper body as stable as possible. So to do this, make sure that you're rolling your shoulders back, you're kind of pinching your back together and your chest is more lifted toward the sky. Not overly done, but just enough that will just help keep you in a stable position in order to lift your legs and not swing. Okay, so we're gonna try to move as quickly as possible into the next exercise, which are gonna be, we're gonna be rotating, doing oblique, leg lifts and we're doing 10 of these five each side and we're also going to be holding ourselves up at the very top okay ready and so crunch your obliques up twisting your knees to the side As you can tell, my arms are nice and tired because I was slowly lowering to the ground. Couldn't hold myself up the whole way. Oh, tiring. Okay, so the next one, we're actually just gonna be hanging and you can grab a weight if you want. I'm gonna use a eight pound dumbbell. You can put it in between your thighs or your ankles, whatever is more comfortable for you. I'm gonna do thighs. And we're gonna hang. And again, with control, we're not using momentum or swinging, just lift up for 10. So it's not only an ab workout, it's a back and arm workout as well. So now we're just gonna take a 30 second break. If you can pause it, if you wanna take a little bit longer, and then we're gonna go do it again, but we're gonna decrease our reps. We're gonna be doing eight reps for the next round. So stretch out, do your thing. All right, round two, eight reps of each exercise. I'm just gonna get rolling. So I'm gonna actually lift up this way. So I was holding to the side up here before. I'm gonna hold up in a chin up position from the front. Whew. 
Okay, eight. Take a quick second and then go into the rotations. All right, so it's gonna be four on each side. And then last one, again, put the weight between your knee, or your knee, your legs, your thighs, whatever. And eight reps, here we go. I like to move fast up and then go a little bit slower on the way down. Okay, another 30 second rest, then we'll do six reps and then we'll be done. Let's see, I do find that like my fingers get a little tense. So in between, gotta stretch them out. Do I look really cool? All right, last round, six reps each, and then we're done. Let's go. Now, if you're at the gym, you can hang and do these. There's just not enough leg room to uh, hang and do that. I also don't like hanging in my joints, so I can do it for one of the rounds, like we do for the last one, but I really don't like hanging for a majority of the time while doing these leg lifts. So anyway, let's get going, six reps. Oblique twists, three each side. Ready, set, go. Almost lost my, lost my grip on that one. But six, and we're all done. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. That's harder.